Yo, what's up everybody? How's it going? Today we're playing Fast Dodo. Also, you know, you could call this Dodo 2, but max movement speed, fast turn rate, no cast point, very low base attack time. Yeah. We got also also Bloodseeker, which this was all random. I did not random Bloodseeker, but Butterfly was nice enough to swap it to me. <laughs> this is actually, actually a sick hero for this. Anyway, we're gonna go fast. Gonna have a good time. We have a uh, massive attack speed, and honestly, like Bloodseeker is just gonna be insane here. So that's cool, right? Let's see if we can find somebody to beat up. I mean, we are just the fastest boys. Anyway, again, this is just this is just fast Dota. This is pretty much exactly what's on the tin, you know. Like this is all it is. <laughs> but like that's really all it needs to be. It's pretty fun for what it is. Alright, it's just kind of like a silly, simple little game mode, but it works pretty well. Anyway, we don't have a courier, which is a bit annoying. Because there's no global shop or anything like that either. But that's alright. We even need a courier, except us and really everybody. <laughs> really, literally everybody. Hello, Tice. Okay, I gotta be. Oh my! Why? Why are you here? Damn, that caught me off guard so fucking hard. I was not ready for somebody just coming in from the sidelines like that. Okay, well, respect, respect. You got me. Yeah, faces void will be scary. Like really, really scary. But it's okay because like. Kind of everybody can get... Yeah, we got him. Damn. <laughs> Bloodseeker. Alright. Uh... Ah, it's not gonna be in time. He's far too quick for that. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm out. Oh, god. Oh, this is not good. Oh no, there's a number one they just keep coming. <laughs> oh man. They just keep coming, dude, man. I thought I was I thought I was out, but uh, they wouldn't let me. I mean I get it. I get it. It's 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 fair and all of that. Like you probably shouldn't just let me escape, but still man. No. You can say goodbye to that. Alright, we have our going nuts passive now, which is just gonna be going even more nuts. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Ah, the bash! Can't handle it. It's too much. Alright. Well, I think it's time for us to maybe buy something that uh, lets us handle it. So, as you might expect, there's some items that are broken in this. And I'm sure you all can already guess which, which item I'm talking about. No, it's actually kind of like a series of items, but there's, there's one in particular that kind of stands out a little bit. <laughs> and uh, that's what we're going to be going for. Hey, Tys. Got him. We got him. Go ahead and just uh, grind our way through some more of these creeps. I don't really want to fight that boy. It's just kind of a little scary, you know? Cause, like, he's got a bash and all of that, and I don't have a bash. Not yet, at least. And, you know, it just seems like something to avoid for the time. Oh, hey, Ties. Woo! Alright, that was kind of close. It's got lifesteal. Oh, no! Alright, you run, boy. Oh, yeah, you run, boy. Oh, no, there's a double one! He just keep coming! <laughs> oh, we got him, though. You know, maybe we should get some life steal. So we saw we saw life steal earlier. Um, the who is it? Somebody has life steal, but yeah. 
Also, I really love what Butterfly is doing here. Using the Fiery Sword to stack up attack speed to just have the nuttiest attack rate. So, maybe we should explain that. Alright, super quick explanation of base attack time and attack speed. Right, so every hero has a base attack time and attack speed. And your attack speed is a value, like, they are kind of like two separate values. Now, usually you can't modify your base attack time. Very, very few heroes can. With only very, very specific tools like Alchemist, right? Um... So that's just kind of like a set value, and the thing that you modify is your attack speed through attack speed items and all of that stuff, right? So, and the higher your attack speed is, the, the faster you attack. Uh, but also, the lower your base attack time is, the faster you attack. And those two things stack, so if you just have a really low base attack time and really fast attack speed, you'll attack really, really fucking quickly. Right? That's just kind of how that works. Also, stop it, bad boy. Alright, we got him. Gotta heal. Come here, boy. No, 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 let me, let me... Oh. <laughs> you don't need no help. Oh, crap. It's okay, we can just beat him up. Yeah. Alright, we're the best. We are the best. Actually, I think, I think Underlord is the best. Look at Underlord just going so nuts. The thing is, like, Underlord has this massive attack speed, and then also just hits so hard. That's what makes him kind of crazy. Oh, well, we are rooted. Oh, man. I actually got pretty close there. So, anyway, as I was saying, though, so... Um, it's kind of like how base attack time and, and attack speed works. Now, Dota is weird, because it displays your attack speed not as your actual attack speed, but instead as your attack speed if you had a base attack time of 1.7, right? Because 1.7 is like the standard. Most heroes have a base attack time of 1.7, but not every hero does, right? But it like the way Dota displays the attack speed value is it just assumes you have, you have 1.7 base attack time. And then whatever your attack rate is, which is dependent on your actual base attack time, so it like, could be a different one. In this mode, you know, it is. Everybody has a different one, right? Um, yeah, it's okay. Wait, you know, I'm going to send this back to the Lena. Um, wait, does this just go into... Oh, Lena's dead. Oh, Lena's dead. Okay. All right. But in this mode, it is a different one. Um, so... It still displays it so highly um, just because it assumes we have 1.7, right? So it like calculates it backwards. It looks at our attack rate and then says, okay, if this is the attack rate, then using the formula, I can deduct how much base, uh, like how much uh, attack speed you have because I'm going to assume you have a base attack time of 1.7. And yeah, it's a little weird. It's kind of how it works though. So even though our attack speed you know, like, so, for example, this right here gives us an attack speed of 10 agility plus 20, so it's 30 attack speed, right? And, but if I drop this, I, oh, 1216, 1451, you know, like, I lose almost 250 attack speed. That's not because I'm actually losing 250 attack speed. I'm still only losing 30 attack speed. It's just our base attack time is so low that the only way Dota knows how to display this is by saying we lose, you know, that much attack speed. It's weird. It doesn't really make a lot of sense. It's just how it works. Got him. Also, I'm the fastest boy. Let's go. Fastest boy alive. <laughs> yeah, I've explained this a few times before, so if you heard this before, then, you know. It's just something I find a little odd. If I was in charge, what I would do is I would just display base attack time. And then just leave attack speed as is. Right, like I would display all the values instead of making one really confusing one. Got him. <laughs> it's kind of a bit silly because, like, we attack, like, the faster we attack, or, like, I guess uh, the more damage you get on them, the faster we attack, right? Which makes us attack even faster, and, or, like, makes us do more damage, and then we, we attack even faster, and all of that stuff. Kind of lets us go nuts. Alright, I'm coming down there, boy. I'm gonna grab myself a Yasha. Because we can uh, go super fast. We're speediest boy. Never forget that. Never forget who's the speediest boy. No, don't throw me in there. That's not how you want to use my talents. You want to use my talents by... 
doing this to Zatza. Help. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I lost him. Oh, he's down there. Okay. <laughs> oh, Batsuka is a silly man. Look at him. Look at him going nuts. So, would Mask of Madness help at all? Yeah, Mask of Madness would actually help. Uh, I kind of like having this, this spells available, but sure, I guess we could go for one. Right? So, like, Mask of Madness, of course, provides a lot of attack speed. And providing a lot of attack speed means we get, uh, like, just actually a crazy amount here. Can't buy that here anymore, right? I don't think you've been able to buy that there for, like, 15,000 patches, but... <laughs> For some reason, I still think that it's it's available in that location. Okay. Let's go ahead and just grab ourselves. Grab ourselves that mask of madness. And have a good day, Salvaco. Have a good day. Oh my god, look at that, Lena. So this is why Lina kind of goes mega nuts. Because Lina can build up a ton of attack speed, right? Like in normal Dota, Lina just attacks super quickly. Well, in here, with fiery soul stacks, this adds up to just the world's most absurd attack speed, right? Like kind of if I activate this and then do that and... Oh, wow, I'm very dead. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, Lina just has a little bit of attack speed, which kind of looks like that now. Go get him! <laughs> She's not that fast, though. Ooh, Sata, you're probably very dead. Oh, and there's, there's the Faceless Void, yeah. Yeah, the Faceless Void is gonna be one of the most difficult ones to go up against. Just because Chronosphere is nasty and comes with an inbuilt permastun. Although, honest, oh my god, you actually got a kill with spells. That's so funny. Oh, there you go. It's okay. Oh, but it was still enough. That was still enough. All right. Aeon Disc is banned. There's absolutely nothing banned. Well, if it was all pick, I would have banned Slaughter. But other than that, there's nothing banned. You know. Slaughter's dumb, because, like, Slaughter just gets the Perma Bash for free, so he can do it immediately. You know, that, that goes a little far. But other than that, you can feel free to buy anything you want. There's no restrictions, really, because what would they be? No, it doesn't really make sense to me. Alright, we'll grab ourselves the Sange. And then we'll probably get a Blink Dagger. That may sound a little weird, but Blink Dagger is actually the best item in this mode. Apart from Basha, I guess. But, like, Blink Dagger is fantastic. Um, you gotta close in on people. And it's actually really hard. Because everybody can kill each other so quickly. Right? Like, what I'm doing to everybody else, they can do to me as well. Like, I might be a little better at it, but not that much. And that's where having some sort of initiation tool, like Invisibility or Blink Dagger, is super handy. Although I like Blink Dagger a lot more. Just in general. <laughs> I just think it's the better item. But, yeah. Well, I'm kind of like hoping to find somebody. Oh, look. I found all of them. I, I don't really want to go in. That's the Faceless Void. Alright, well, we got him. Woo! Who's here? Come here, boy! <laughs> We're going fast! <laughs> uh, where did he go? No, he's out. Alright. Okay. Oh, there's Nux. Got him. All right, let's get out of here. No, that's not 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 ended yet. That would be kind of lame, though. All right, speediest boy. 
Well, Tiny with low base attack time actually sounds kind of neat. You know, he gets some damage. Although, like, Grow has been... I don't know. Grow just doesn't even really give damage anymore. It makes me sad. Like, Grow used to give a lot of damage. And now it's just, like, half 30. And, like, that's a talent. That's not an ultimate. You know, like, the thing that makes Grow an ultimate is really just the, the, the armor. But that's kind of lame. That's not what Grow is supposed to be about. Tiny's ultimate has just been ruined, frankly speaking. I kind of think the rest of the changes they, changes they made to the hero are fine. But I do not like the... Damn it. Do not like what they did with the ultimate. Damn, you do damage, boy! Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's actually such an excellent strategy. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love it. That's so clever. The Oracle Ultimate and Blade Mail. Uh, I can't kill you, but I can kill myself. And boy, do I kill myself quickly. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Damn. Machine gun. Alright, I kind of want to get like a moon shard. I want to attack that quickly. That's crazy. That's crazy. The dual tiny with bashback would be OP. Oh, yeah. What was it called? Craggy? Dude, Craggy would be crazy. Oh my god, he got both those kills. Throw him up, throw him up, you can do it! Oh, not anymore. That was a kill. I think Tiny I think Tiny wins that fight every time, actually. His ult is tree volley now. Yeah, and I don't like that. I really just like I gotta say, okay, this is kind of like I guess getting sidetracked a little bit now, but I don't really know how I don't really like how they're treating the Agonims. Because it does often feel like what they're doing with Agonims isn't there. They aren't so much like creating an additional option for the hero, they're just creating something that, like a mandate for the hero you know they're creating something that's just this is required you don't have a choice and um you know that's kind of not great you know i i feel like with all tiny you often have the choice whether or not you wanted to go for some sort of like carry build or you want to go for you know just like casting or agonims was like an in-between kind of i don't know I'm coming! I'm the fastest to have ever lived. Oh, <laughs> I actually am, though. I actually am, though. <laughs> oh my god. I am actually the fastest to have ever lived. The speediest boy. Let me grab. The moon shard. Oh, yeah. Now we're talking. Look at my attack speed. I'm kind of surprised Dota can even handle this. Oh, he bashed me! Okay, we're banished. No way, we can't do this. <laughs> so you just gotta believe in yourself. Oh my god. Wait, is this just my illusion? Is my illusion slaughtering stuff right now? That might be a problem. Alright, so at 25 we of course got the, the... You know, the first... We wanna go fast. Oh, we wanna go so fast. Hello, Skyriff. No, well, Skyriff is uh, not really. This is not not Skyriff's mode, which is weird. Usually, every game mode is Skyriff's mode. You know, like Skyriff gets to go nuts in everything, but I don't think in this one. In this one, Skyriff just gets to chill a bit. Man, I'm dead though.
I don't like it. <laughs> All right, well, I'm just gonna wait until I'm back at life, and then let's see if we can maybe put an end to this. I mean, I can activate this now. I do a lot more damage. Was a dialogue quicker, which is maybe not great. Why aren't you going for that? He's gonna appear in there again. No? No boy's fast, alright. Oh, not fast, Chrono! Oh my god! That was. Okay. I'll, 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 I'll give you a prop for that. That was a good chrono, man. That was a speedy one. And if that one wasn't as fast as it, like, if that one hadn't been as fast as it ended up being, that definitely wouldn't have, um, you know, like, I, I would have gotten that kill for sure. I only got a single attack out. Considering my attack speed, that's incredibly impressive how quickly he used that. If only that was a bash. <laughs> if only that single attack would have been a bash, that would have made things a lot easier, wouldn't it? Wait, you had... Oh, you had vision on me? Yeah, I guess. I was killing the creeps. I mean, like, maybe I wasn't that subtle. Alright, alright. Have you seen Joker? Nah, I don't really think I'm gonna go watch it. It doesn't really sound that fun. To be honest, it just doesn't really seem that interesting. And I know it's like the internet's new baby. Everybody's like, Joker, so good. But I just don't give a shit about the Joker. <laughs> I really don't care at all. And I'm just not really interested. Alright. Oh, are we are we fighting right now? Wow, you're dead. Oh everybody's dead. Alright, let's just end it then. Got it! Got it. Alright. Alright. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating on the video. I would definitely appreciate that. And I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.